lawyer has said, please refer to them and they, not he and him. The government is identifying as being non-binary, and CNN is confused. Attorneys for the accused shooter, Anderson Lee Aldrich, say in new court filings tonight that the suspect now identifies as non-binary. In a footnote to a motion asserting legal privileges, the public defenders say, quote, Anderson Aldrich is non-binary. They use they, them pronouns, and for the purposes of all formal filings, will be addressed as Mix Aldrich. So in other words, not Mr. or Ms. I don't know what to say about that. I mean, that's not anything that we had heard from his background. You know, people have been looking into his background. And uh, I don't know if anybody here, are you guys lawyers? I mean, you know, I don't know if, I, I don't know what to say about that. I mean. Welcome to another FOE. I don't know what to say about that. All you guys do is peddle propaganda and you jump to conclusions. Immediately, that guy was supposed to be, from my understanding, a white supremacist, Trump voter, guy that hates gays. Now we're finding out this guy's part of the community. I have a special message for the gay community. I mean, I have 38 subscribers, and I'm sure this isn't gonna reach any gay guy. But hey, if it reaches one of you guys, I'll be happy. I am from the other side and I'm reaching out. It's good to hear things from the other side. What you motherfuckers need is to tote guns. Y'all gay niggas need the blicky. Blicky means gun, firearms. You guys gotta get off that group mentality that because you guys are liberals, you hate guns. Had the bartenders in that bar had guns behind the bar or in the office, that guy would have killed less people. Probably would have killed maybe one or two, then he would have been shot. Thank God they were able to subdue him physically, but that's luck. A lot of guys are not gonna let you get that close. <laughs> you get, the gay community needs to tow guns. The gay community needs guns. Yeah, I need to come to the right. You guys need, need your second amendment rights. Because if you're so discriminated against, if you think everybody hates you, and for the most part, even if, if gay guys don't hate you, then we don't want to be around you guys. It's just, just a fact of life. I mean, a lot of people are not going to admit it. I don't have that problem. I have no problem with gay guys, but I don't want to be around you guys. Because you guys are too feminine, and you guys embarrass me. It's just, it's just me. It's just, I might embarrass you. I'm too, I may be too ghetto, and you guys don't want to be around me because I embarrass you, and I'm poor. Gay guys have money, at least here in Miami. So, like, who fucking cares, dude? It doesn't mean I want to kill you guys, so you guys want me dead. We don't, we don't, we're not going to click. We're not going to click. But I am a bartender myself, and, you know, I serve a lot of gay dudes. So it's like, fuck, bro. I don't want to see you fucking guys get killed either. What the fuck is that? Great tippers, you know, for the most part, good people. Respectful, give or take. You know what I mean? Not the most respectful community, from my opinion. But a lot of respectful and good guys that, that I meet um, at my job. And uh, what you guys need is a gun. You guys got to change that mentality. You guys are not a group. You guys are individuals. And back to the, back to the discrimination. If everybody's going to discriminate against you guys, and we, and we all know that it's kind of true, so why won't you protect yourself? Why won't you take the responsibility of your protection upon yourself? You know what I mean? That's my message for the gay community, guys. You guys, uh, look at that. I got a rainbow shirt on and everything. You feel me? You feel me? Y'all niggas need to tote guns. And y'all and don't need to celebrate yourselves like that, bro. I don't know if that's wrong, but like... I could celebrate my culture a little bit more, but I choose not to, man. Because for what? Yeah, I, yeah, it's, you know, I want to be myself more, but for what? It, the, the benefits, you know, don't outweigh the, ne the negatives for me. If I act like a ghetto Dominican, that just wants to fuck every fat ass that, that, that walks around, and I just want to drink and fucking chill, you know what I mean? You don't want to act like that, man, even if that's who you really are inside. You know, 
Be human before you're gay, before you're black, before you're Hispanic. Man, be human. That, that's the problem with everybody. We think too much of ourselves and too little of the world. I'm ranting now, man. FOE. I'm out of here, guys.